What is going on, sports fans? It is Sportsbook Review here, your guide to unbiased, authentic, and unfiltered sportsbook reviews and betting analysis. We are here in Phoenix, Arizona, for the pinnacle of all sporting events here in North America, Super Bowl 57. And to make it a little bit more specific, we are here at the Phoenix Convention Center, Media Row, covering all the pre-Super Bowl right down here, and we're going to show you all the craziness that goes into elevating your experience for Super Bowl 57. Not many people get to see it, so I thought I would show it to you. A lot of things happening behind the scenes. It is chaos, but controlled chaos. A lot of media outlets here, a who's who of media, pretty much, and we're here as well. So without further ado, let's head on inside because this place is starting to get a little bit crazy. Got my media pass here, and we're going to show you all of the amazing things happening down inside of the Phoenix Convention Center. So I'm just here at Hall 1 on the lower level here in the convention center, and there it is, the media center. Let's head on inside and see what's going on. As you can see, the Sirius XM setup is quite serious. So much going on. So many personalities, so many stars. It is, truly is a who's who of the NFL world. Throw more than 100 media outlets in one giant ballroom. Mix in NFL stars, former players, and other quasi-celebrities, and you get Radio Row during Super Bowl week. This year, a total of 128 organizations, including Sportsbook Review, have representation at North America's biggest sporting event. It is the largest contingent of media outlets ever, according to the NFL. Included in that are over 6,000 media members from 24 countries accredited to cover the Super Bowl and related events. After all, with over 100 million people tuning in to watch the Super Bowl, it's go big or go home. And yes, even the sports books have representation here in Phoenix this week, including DraftKings, FanDuel, Caesars, and more. With the American Gaming Association anticipating a record-breaking Super Bowl 57 in terms of betting, with initial projections showing that around 20% of American adults are looking to place a bet on the big game, there is no doubt about why some of the biggest names in sports betting are here. In fact, initial projections have revealed that over 50 million Americans plan on betting on Super Bowl 57, with around $16 billion expected to be wagered, which more than doubles last year's estimates. There's just so much going on inside of this room. It's just so compact, so many people, so many television networks. Absolute, like I said, controlled chaos. Very, very cool. Saw Emmett Smith walk by me, Larry Fitzgerald, a bunch of other NFL legends. It's just uh, quite amazing. Uh, it says, who smells the best on your team and who smells the worst? I smell the best 
And the old line smell the worst. <laughs> the offensive line. You could be any animal, what would you be? My shirt means I'm gonna be a flamingo, so I'm gonna go with that. <laughs> and just right behind me, that is Pat McAfee. He is recording the Pat McAfee show live from Arizona. We're kind of live here too. I think he has got uh, Taylor Haneke on there right now. So. Hey, only three. Hit questions. It's bad luck. What are they? It's not bad luck. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's one of those. Those are It seems like every famous person has descended upon Phoenix for the Super Bowl, with some even making it to Radio Row here. That is it for Sportsbook Review here in Phoenix at the Phoenix Convention Center ahead of Super Bowl 57. For now, have fun betting and bet responsibly. See you later.